Well, Waco police are on the hunt for vandals tonight, responsible for shooting out several car windows that happened over the weekend, and they were using a BB gun. Fox 44's Maribel Santiago joining us now in the newsroom. Maribel, they're working on at least 35 cases and keeping glass repair centers pretty busy. That's right. This actually all began late Friday night, and they believe that there could be more unreported cases out there. And since then, no one has provided any information on a sub suspect description. And tonight, they're needing your help to hunt down those vandals. I've got several calls, calls over the weekend, and uh, I knew it was going to be a rough Monday morning when I showed up. At Freddy's Glass, installers were on their toes cleaning up the mess vandals left behind this weekend. They're hitting more than one glass, so it's like they're sitting there and just target practicing, you know, more than one, you know, door glass, back glass, and a couple of other glasses. Co-owner Rodney Duran says they worked on about 15 cars, windows shattered from what looks like a pellet gun. Police say the reports come from areas around 15th to 25th Streets to Cumberland and Waco Drive. At this point, no suspects, but we're looking for anything. Suspicious vehicles, persons wandering in the neighborhood, those kind of incidents, and maybe they can help us solve a bunch of these. Sergeant Patrick Swanton says they don't believe the houses were targeted, only the neighborhood. What we're asking our community and our citizens is, as always, watch out for each other. And if somebody saw something, please reach out to us and let us know. So police can put an end to the crime and a nuisance to fork up cash for an unexpected windshield replacement. There's people out there that are just being mean, and they need to think about that it's just costing uh, families are either trying to get ahead or do something special for themselves, you know, so uh, please think about other people. Now, police say depending on the damage done by the suspects, they could either face anywhere from a misdemeanor to a felony. But in the meantime, if you need to report anything, do report that to police immediately. Live in the newsroom, Maribel Santiago, Fox 44 News.